Hi guys, it's me Malcolm, the movie Wizard of Oz himself. And as you may know, I'm here at Art Like Cinemas, Culver City. I just love this theater. Here. Here. You know, before this was Art Like, this was Pacific Theaters. Here's, here's, um, it, yeah, five, three years ago, years ago, but unfortunately they changed, they changed it and, and it became Art Like Cinemas. I used to, I come here, come here once in a while though, but enough about that. Sorry, I'm pausing like this. It's, there's so many people here because because of the new movie they saw, which I'm talking about my review of. Okay, I, I'm here to discuss my review of the of the new movie, Venom. Venom. I gotta admit, Venom was the best comic book movie I have seen in decades. In decades. It had it had some dark humor, the violence violence and and the bond between Eddie and the symbiote. I gotta admit, Tom Hardy was the best actor to portrait as Eddie Brock. I mean first he did I mean first he did Bane then Matt Max, now Eddie Brock. <laughs> Is there any role that he can't do? Tom, if you're watching this, I, you are the best actor, I, uh, actor who could portrait as Venom. Screw Topper, Topper Grace. Grace. He, he was the worst. But no offense, Topper. If you're watching this, I still love you. And I still love you in that 70s show. <laughs> okay. Well, so while I was on Rotten Tomatoes, I looked at the score for, score for this movie, and it gave it a 28, 28%, which sucks. I did not see that coming. I mean, but on the other hand, yeah, this morning I saw the audience score and they gave it an 89%, which is awesome. I can't believe it. I absolutely am shocked and appalled by this. I mean it in a good way because I still love this movie. I got it. It has the same diversity. It, by, it has the same diversity with the other, other good movies that have, that have rotten scores on Rotten Tomatoes, such as Billy Madison, The Boondock Saints, Jumanji, and not to mention my favorite Halloween movie, Hocus Pocus. That, that was. I got to admit, those movies do not deserve a rotten score. Those, cri those critics back in the days should go F themselves. So, but enough about that, let's continue with the movie. I got to admit, I love every single scene I love every single, every single scene of it, and I, okay, once again, so many people leaving out, and it is late, so I think it's time to wrap this up quickly, quickly. I do admire Michelle Williams in this one, I'm amazed that she, okay, I'm not going to give any spoilers for this movie. So, shh, no spoilers. 
point is, I love Michelle Wu. Um, she was the be best love interest for Eddie Brock. Huh? I wish I could see more of her in... Never mind. Stupid. Stupid. Forget, forget what I'm trying to say. So, for this movie, I like to give it a 10. Yes, you hear me right. I, Malcolm Cooper, give the movie Venom a 10. <laughs> God, this is such a good, good place to go to movies. Well, guys, I guess it's time for me to turn in. It's late anyway. I have to get home. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and be sure you all watch the movie Venom this weekend. Bye.